when you're trying to connect your iPod Shuffle 4th generation to Windows 10 or 11 to add songs or to restore the device, if iTunes can't find, can't detect the device, it can't recognize it, that means the iPod Shuffle's name does not show up in the device list, then in this video, we are going to solve this problem for you. First, before anything else, make sure your iPod Shuffle have enough charge. And also, please make sure when it's connected to your PC and you're looking for it and can't find it, it's turned on. Now, if it's already turned on, what you can do is just turn it off, wait for around 10 seconds, and then turn it back on. If it's still not showing up, just eject or disconnect the device. At the same time, make sure you're using an Apple approved cable to connect it with your PC. If you've already checked everything is still not showing up, Sometimes it happens for the firewall port issue. So in that case, you can switch or change the port and try again. If it's still not showing up, and if you have another USB device or pen drive, use it to check if your USB ports are functional. If your PC can detect the USB device, but not your iPod shuffle, there might be something wrong with the cable. So in that case, if any spare or extra cable is available to you, you can use that and try again. Also, if there is an extension USB hub or dongle available to you, you can use that as well. If none of the devices, including your extra USB device is not detecting, just go ahead straight restart your Windows. It will solve any minor software glitch. After the restart, if the USB port and the cable all are okay, your iPod shuffle will recognize and start showing the LED charging light. But especially if you're using this iPod shuffle to this specific device for the first time, if you open iTunes, you will get this pop-up. Just go ahead, download and install the software. And after that, your Windows or iTunes will have no trouble finding or recognizing your iPod shuffle. Thanks for watching.